Assalamualaikum and good morning. My name is Ita Maskura Piti Muhammad Nordin and my matrix card number is 15 the 18 19 of 2002. I am the general manager of Brazilicious Enterprise and my responsibility is to manage overall of the business and to make sure that our business is operating well. Next is about our company's organizational plan. Brazilicious Enterprise vision is to be world's recognized brand and people's favorite snack to fill their chocolate cravings, while our mission is to delight and nourish our customers with high quality and excellent services at a reasonable price. Second is to make sure that our product will be known through all Malaysia and to achieve customer satisfaction by putting customers' priority first and build their trust toward us. Our last mission is to deliver the best guest services experience with a sense of warmth and friendliness. As we can see, this is our company logo. Prezilicious is the combination words of pretzel and delicious. It's described that we are selling a delicious pretzel dipped with melted chocolate. While the background color defines that our product reaches with the sweetness of chocolate and truly from high quality ingredients. Next is our target market. Target market is a group of people with some share characteristic that a company has identified as potential customer for the products. Identifying the target market informs the decision making processes as a company designs, packages and markets its product. Our main target market is for people who love chocolate from all ages and for those who love less sugar snacks to eat anytime and anywhere. Usually, the people that buy our product are teenagers and students. Let's move to our company's marketing strategy. A marketing strategy is the long-term planning of business objectives that our company wants to achieve. For this to be achieved, it is important to choose well the specific actions to consolidate the reputation of products and services to increase sales in the market. We will make sure our customers are satisfied with our services and products and we will keep in touch with them. So, we can improve any weaknesses that we have. Our market strategy divides into three, which are price strategy. For our price strategy, we use competitor best pricing, which means we compare our price with other similar businesses. This is because we want our price to be comparable with the market price and can be acceptable to many people. The second one is distribution strategy. We serve our customer directly by using our agent to deliver customers' purchases to their doorstep. This is because we want to maintain our high quality services. We also provide postages using courier services to Sabah and Sarawak since we don't have agent from there. The last one is promotion strategy. Advertising is one of our promotion strategy, which we spread posters and flyers. This method is used to attract more customers from many city and make sure our businesses are by, known by other. Other than that, we also use media social as our promotion strategy. This is one of the easiest methods to reach the customer. By using the latest technology, we can spread our business active effectively. For example, we use Instagram, Facebook, and WhatsApp to promote our products. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum and a very good morning to Puan Faizatul and my fellow friends. Let me introduce myself. My name is Nurhadira Natasha binti Muhammad Saleh. My metric number is 15D1819F2021. I am a production manager in Presidential Enterprise and my responsibility is planning and organizing a production schedule and determining quality control standards. My duties also is agreeing on budget and schedule with a manager and client. Let me introduce about our company. The nature of business in our company. Our business is called Prezalicious Enterprise. We sell a unique snack from other small business. We innovate by upgrading the shapes and taste of food to suit everyone's taste. Our product use many unique flavors such as a crunchy brazil and a premium chocolate flavor filled with a lot of uh, almond. Next, next is a detail of the company. Previously, the company was in the form of sole proprietorship. A few months later, the business changed it from its form form to a partnership, which consists of four people, which is Intel Mastura as a general manager. Nurhadira Natasha as a production manager, 
Wan Nurul Amira binti Wan Asri as a marketing manager and Rabiatul Adawiyah as a financial manager. Our business has been operating from 21st October 2021 until today and on that day, we registered the company with Surah and Jaya Syarikat Malaysia SSM. We also, we also receive a positive response from customer regardless of age. Moreover, the location of the business. Our business operates in Kota Mutiara Damansara, Taling Jaya Selangor. We choose the location because it is a very strategic area. It is located in a city in Petaling Jaya, surrounded by institution, a factory near of housing area. It, con it can contribute customer resources for us on this opportunity to create a higher sales target. Moreover, this location sufficient parking lots that we have found a way to convince for our customer. Furthermore, future prospect of business. For business owner, keeping one eyes on the future can help us to become better to navigate challenges, identify opportunities, and planning outcomes we want to see. First thing first, we would like to improve the quality of focus in the company in order to upgrade and provide a better quality service to our lovely customer. We plan to hire an experienced worker who have an experience as a waiter and waitress for at least one year. Last but not least, factor in selecting the proper venture. There are few reasons that Presalicious Enterprise is a chosen as the proper business. We have decided to establish this business due to the opportunity and potential to earn profit in Petaling Jaya Selangor area is a higher. In addition to do that, we have some reason to attract us to start this business and its location. There are, we observe that Petaling Jaya area is a lack of Brazil modern, especially our brand, which are Brazil crunchy from Brazilicious Enterprise. Therefore, there is a great opportunity to our business to establish in this area. Okay, hi, Assalamualaikum. My name is Rabiatul Adawiyah binti Muhammad Kusairi. Number metric 15-1819F2007. Uh, my skills in this business are communication and computer skills and had experience as be an assistant accountant with Yonas Young Company. I, as a financial Financial manager for our company, my task is to monitoring account, preparing activity report and financial forecast. Other than that, uh, investigate the ways to improve profitability and analyze market for business opportunity for our company. Okay, this is the purpose of preparing business plan for our company. The purpose of preparing this business plan is very important and strategic tools for our company. A good business plan not only helps our company to focus on the specific steps necessary to make business ideas success, but it also helps to achieve short-term and long-term objective. Then the purpose of doing the business plans are first to show the financial strength of the company, especially when applying for loans and to convince the investor towards providing funds or other financial institutions. After that, it is as a guideline for us in setting, planning, managing, handling, and controlling our business for day-to-day -day management, budget, financial forecast, strategies, target market, and even long-term good. Other than that, it is to improve any weaknesses arise by comparing the actual performance of the firm with its master plan. It is to see whether it is a favorable or unfavorable situation. Uh, lastly, it is to communicate our ideas with stakeholders. Um, a business plan is a communication tool that we can use to secure investment capital from financial institutions or lenders. It is to convince people to work for our enterprise, to secure credit from supplier and to attract potential customers. Let's move to the first point, which is our company's background. Our company's name is Prazalicious Enterprise, and the form of our business is partnership. 
Our business is commenced on 7 October 2021 and our building are located at Mutiara Damansara 1, Petaling Jaya, Selangor. If supplier or any people that have any business inquiries, they can contact us through email prezalicioushq at gmail.com or contact our business mobile number. Next slide is, a, is the partnership agreement. Before I start the detail about our company agreement, let me introduce my partnership, which consists uh, four people, which is Intan Mastura binti Muhammad Nordin as a general manager. Next is myself, is Nur Hadira Natasha binti Muhammad Saleh as a production manager. We also have a marketing manager, which is Wan Nurul Amira binti Wan Asri. Last but not least, uh, our financial manager is Sabriatul Adawiya binti Muhammad Kusairi. So, let me let we move to a partnership agreement. The location of the business is in Mutiara Damansara, Petaling Jaya, Selangor. We also use online selling uh, as our platform to promote our product, such as in Facebook, uh, Facebook, Instagram, and WhatsApp. The equity contribution in the company is preparing the statement of financial position and the statement of profit and loss. We will open this. We will open the business until a bankruptcy. Resolution Enterprise provide EPF, bonus, so-so, insurance, public holiday, and annual leave to our employees. Now let's see our company's main organizational chart, which is consists of general manager that is myself, and the second one is production manager that planning and organizing production schedule of the business is carried by Nur Hadira Natasha Bitti Muhammad Saleh and the third one is marketing manager that gather marketing information and preparing advertisement and pro promotion which is carried by Wan Nurul Amirah binti Wan Asri and lastly is financial manager that preparing financial activity report of our businesses and forecast activity which is carried by Rabia Tul Adawiyah binti Muhammad Khusairi I think that's all from me for today thank you Hi, Assalamualaikum to my fellow friends and my lecturer, Haja Faizah Etul. My name is Wanur Amir binti Wan Asriya. My metric number is 15-18-19-F-2223. In the group assignment task for this time, I and other members of my group have set up our business by selling pretzel cookies. In this business, I hold the position of marketing manager. My responsibility as one of marketing manager is that I need to gather market research, decide and control the quality and quantity of the production and prepare advertisement and promotion of the company. Now we look what is involved in marketing planning in our business. Marketing can be defined as an activity that carry out systematically to encourage and increase sales of products or services as long as the activities are in line with religious and ethical practice. Marketing is the one important factor that can help the company to increase the sales of its products. As you can see in my slide right now, this is our group description is our business. Next, our company have a market strategy. We define for our product as a cookies. This is because our product has a many advantage. Pizza delicious enterprise has a weaker characteristics for our company. This is because to make sure that our product is a high quality. A few characteristics in our results are our products can fulfill the customer needs, determinations of the price that appropriates with the quality of products. For the importance of the quality of the products, we use high quality ingredients. It is very important for Prezalicious Enterprise to identify our competitors. As we know, competitors is fulfill the other business that offers similar products or services. Their sales point to help to achieve the overall goals and consistent customer base or the continued sales. Based on market survey has been done, we get that there are one competitors for our business which is NTN. As you can see in my, in my slide right now, this is strengths and weakness for our business and, and competitors. Then we have our target market in this business which is Prezalicious Enterprise is located at Mutari Damasara Pachaling Jaya Selangor. Generally, the premise is a shop house situated in city with near educational office, factory and housing area and more facility nearby our premise or premise. Target markets will refer to a group of customer or buyer with similar traits that the organizations want to attract to with their products offering. There are several reasons why business decide on specific target market. The first reason is that this is impractical and impossible for our business to offer a product that can satisfy the needs and funds to entire populations. The second reason is the most business community is limited sources in terms of times. 
This limitations means that the business community must focus its activities on attracting a core groups of customer. So by producing these products will make the highest potential to purchase the good products offered it. Next, we move to operational plan. Operations unit is one of the most important part in our business organizations because the true the organizations of its product is will lead to the business goods. From these operations of our business company, we also maximize the profit gains. All activity in this operation will be done according to the plan so that it will meet our customer expectations. In these terms of office, we are ensuring that these products of our table will be produced continuously to fulfill the increasing demands from publics. This operation states the information about the cost of products, salaries of workers, operations hours, operations budget, and list of suppliers of raw materials and others. And our operational objective is to make the operating plan run properly and well organized and to satisfy customer needs and fulfill their demand. We provide high quality products and timely service. Our business hours is our business is open for X hours a day, starting for 8 a.m. until 5 p.m. every Monday and Saturday of day or Sunday. Amenities and facilities in our business is premise the premise business enterprise has all the amenities such as A, electric supplies, air conditionings, L telephone bills, internet bills and others. Okay, this is part of financial plan. The financial plan is the step in the preparation of business plan. The financial plan is a snapshot of the current state of businesses. The projections inform our short and long term financial goals and give us a starting point for developing a strategy. Strategies of financial planning. First is to make sure that our company has sufficient amount of cash in order to trade account to maintain credit rating and to meet unexpected cash needs. Second, to give an opinion to other departments, such as administration, marketing and operating in order to reach the business objective. Lastly, to make sure the increase in business profit at the good stage. Okay, this is project implementation cost schedule and source of finance. As you can see, our total cost is 124,445 ringgit. And total of loan is thirty-five thousand ringgit. Okay, as you can see, it is a statement of financial position for the first year for our company. Um, the total for non current asset we got um one hundred six thousand eight hundred seventy-one ringgit. Current asset, which is uh, cash in hand and bank, is ten thousand ringgit. The other asset is three hundred eight three thousand ringgit. So total for non current asset and current asset is one hundred nineteen thousand eight hundred seventy-one ringgit. Other than that, um, the total owner's equity is 62,000 plus we 18,000, so we get 80,000 ringgit. So uh, the long term liabilities is 35,000 and current liability is 4,871 4, ringgit. So the total for equity and liabilities is 119,871 ringgit. Okay, next let me show our income statement for 3 years. As you can see, a gross profit in year 1 is same with year 2 which is 698,000 ringgit and increase in year 3 796,500 ringgit and then the total expenses that we get in 3 years is 460,630 ringgit so the net profit is increased from year 1 until year 3 next slide is project implement schedule our company has been doing several type of assignment throughout the year for 2021. As you can see, on the first task, we did a renovation for our company by repairing a damage and adding a beauty to customer certification so that our customer will feel comfortable to shopping with us. The next task is the start of the business. After doing the renovation, we started the business in April 2021. At the beginning of the opening our business, the business went smoothly. There are many customers from all over the country and states visiting our company, which is one of the attraction, attraction in the area in Petaling Jaya. Apart from that, we also made a big opening in the task tree by inviting a local artist, namely Nain Daniel, Shukri Yahya, and many other rising artists to promote our company to be known throughout Malaysia. During these activities, our company has received a good news 
from superior that our company has exceeded the sale set by the company. This grand opening lasted for six months. Furthermore, our task for of doing a promotion throughout the opening of large scale company is done. We have hired several influencers and artists to promote our product to be known by all Malaysians. We also promote our product on Instagram, WhatsApp, and Facebook. Our company use social media as the main platform because our target market consists of teenagers, children, and adults from the age of 5 years old to 35 years old. So the use of social media has also made our product known to the whole of Malaysia, especially from teenager. Last but not least, the last task we provide is the Sochi and Sopi. For the last two months, we need to make a closing by providing a financial statement to the financial manager. The preparation of financial statement is a very important so that our company can see the inflow and outflow of the company over the year. Okay, that's all from me. Thank you. Okay, last but not least is the conclusion. Based on the planning and projection of income and expenses, our company is very confident that this business will be progressed smoothly in the future. Our company has the potential to become a highly regarded source in local, national and international market. We hope in future our product will be more successful business as there is the analysis from all business perspective. However, uh, the calculations show that plan can be successful and give profit in few years. And we hope the vision and mission for our business will become reality. Other than that, we hope we will achieve our vision to become the only product is the best in producing a DZ and to make sure that our product will be available through all Malaysia. Okay, that's all from me. Thank you.